The question is, are your choices good or bad? Welcome to today's TDRX. In the coming weeks from today, we're going to be looking at new prescription. And the prescription is check your choices. In this uncertain time, in this unprecedented time, you need to check your choices. Deuteronomy 3015, I call heaven and earth as witnesses today against you that I have set before you life and death, blessing and cursing. Therefore, choose life that both you and your descendant may live. One of the gifts given to us by God is the ability to choose. The power to choose is very great and we'll make choices all day. In fact, we choose our clothes, we choose our breakfast, we choose the time we go to bed, the time we wake up. Even with all the guidelines given to us by the government, we have a choice to put our mask on. We have a choice to use the hand sanitizer. So we make hundreds of choices daily. The question is, are your choices good or bad? Your choices today determine the way your tomorrow will pan out. Check your choices and make sure they are in line with the Word of God. Because our choices determine our spiritual maturity. Psalm 37 verse 23 says, The steps of a good man are ordered by the Lord, and he delights in his ways. So if you allow God to choose for you, you end well. The future is glorious. So your choices are set in your heart before you see with your eyes. For example, Jesus had a choice to stay in heaven, but he came to earth to suffer, to redeem mankind. He could have ignored even the death on the cross, the suffering, but he chose to, to die. He could have come down from the cross, but he chose not to come down. So your choice will determine how far you go in life. Your choice determines your success and failure in every venture. So the change that is happening now, we don't have control over it, but you have control over your choice. And you can decide to do the right thing. I want to conclude with Micah 6, 8. He has shown you, O man, what is good and what does the Lord require of you, but to do justly, to love mercy, and to walk humbly with your God. Uh, check your choices. Thank you.